Excuse me. Hey, fam. Thank y'all so much for being here with me. Tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is, so let's just go ahead and tap in with spirit. Get this tea for y'all real quick. See what's really going on in this general collective energy. But no matter what comes out, fam, please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Also, the messages are always timeless. So whenever you come across this message, that's exactly what spirit has it for you. To all the subscribers and members of the channel, I thank y'all so, so much for, you know, just rocking and rolling with me. I greatly do appreciate each and every one of you guys. Even if you're not subscribed, fam, or a member of the channel, I thank you so, so much for coming and viewing the message. <coughs> Excuse me. You know, just spending some of your time with me. I greatly do appreciate you. But anywho, y'all, let's go on and get into this message. I hope y'all doing well wherever y'all are in this crazy-ass world. I'm just sitting there looking out the window in the skies. It was like so clear. And then all of a sudden, this one cloud just come out of nowhere. So it's like, mm, what's that about? But anywho, fam, let's go on and get into this. Let's see what's going on. Personal readings as well as the memberships are open, fam. <laughs> oh, child, why I get the energy of somebody? Is somebody going to bump into y'all today? Like, I don't know why this person going to bump you like that. But fam, try your damn just to keep your cool. Because it feel like somebody really got a problem with you. And you know that message that I posted yesterday. Somebody really want a reaction out of you for one reason or another. So yeah, just, just keep your cool. Because I do feel like somebody going to be on some type of shady shit today. But anywho, let's get into this message. Oh, child. <laughs> they, they really be trying, don't they? Yeah, we got the eight of ones right here. <laughs> so... <laughs> Y'all, it's something to go down on social media. It's something that you can't see, though, because you possibly block somebody or something like that. But it's something here that somebody on social media, they want you to clap back, but Spirit is telling you to stand your ground because, you know, words can't hurt you, fam. Yeah, it could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some of y'all going to be like, how in the hell did I even get mixed up in this? Yeah, y'all, some of y'all don't have no idea what's really going on. But some of y'all on social media, you could be the topic of conversation for uh, some reason today. Yeah, the Ten of Cups right here. Oh, my. Mm. Yeah, oh, this guy's, yeah, oh, shit. Is this somebody new that y'all dealing with? Somebody that they got a family with on social media uh, shooting slugs or something like that. Somebody could even be pregnant at this time. So, I don't know what this is. So, there might be a pregnancy in there. Okay, fam, turn it down. So, let's say you already have children with somebody. And there is like a pregnancy announcement or something like that. And for some reason, you're the topic of conversation here. And I don't feel like it's you making the pregnancy announcement. It could be. Yeah, Moon Core, you don't know nothing about this. So, there is somebody right here. They're making some type of pregnancy announcement. Or there is some kind of social media post or something like this. And for some reason, you're being talked about on this post in the comments or something like that for some fucking reason. Let's get into this. Holy Spirit, what's the message here? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't understand. Yeah, the seducer right here to the two of swords, to the nine of ones. Some of y'all could be dealing with the water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Sag Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, we got the five of ones right here. Y'all don't know that this is going on. Yeah. There's somebody here that won't smoke with you or something like that. It feel like this person is like secretly doing something or in secret competition with you or something like that. Hmm. Holy Spirit, what's the message here? Okay. Yeah, we ain't taking all of those. We got the six of swords. Somebody is doing something here. And it's kind of like to uh, break your heart, put you in your feelings, make you upset, envious, jealous, or something like that. Yeah, we got the queen of this. Some of y'all, you have children with somebody. But you, you're not with this person. I feel like some of y'all could be single mothers here. Very intuitive as well. Yeah, we got the A of I don't know what this is about you. I heard something about your ex-husband. Oh, my goodness. What we finna do? Because I'm hearing Daryl. What in the hell is this that somebody trying to bring towards you? 
There's also somebody right here. I don't know what this is about your appearance that they're talking about on social media. But yeah, Aries, Taurus energy. This got something to do with a masculine and a feminine energy. And it's, this is craziness. It's already finna be some type of drama field shit out here already. Yeah. Even whomever this masculine energy is, it really feel like they don't even understand why somebody is involving you in whatever this is. Because you and this person, y'all could live like in different cities or states or something like that. Or it's some type of distance between you and this masculine energy. So they don't even understand why this new person is bringing you up in the in the conversation yeah we got the four swords truths right here it really feel like you and this masculine don't have no issues with each other but there's somebody in the middle that's trying to make it be something i don't know what this is yeah the empress right here i'm telling y'all either you have children with this person or there is a pregnancy announcement but for some reason somebody throwing shade at you on this post yeah <laughs> I don't understand. Yeah, look what pops out. The Ace of Swords. That's the truth. What are we doing? <laughs> yeah, it's some type of information coming out. It's the truth, whatever it is. But Yeah, look. Internet Trolls comes on by Glorilla. Shouts. Exactly. It's something happening on social media. Y'all don't, y'all can't see this. Y'all don't know anything about it, but I don't know, child. Yeah, the Ten of Cups. This is about somebody that y'all already have a family with. It feels like you and this person have no issues with each other, but they possibly have another baby on the way. If this is the case, they, um, whomever this is, they got pregnant. This person childish as fuck. Because it's like, shit, I don't feel like you would have no problem with this person. Hell, it's a new addition to the family. You know what I'm talking about? Some of y'all, they don't understand that you made peace with a certain situation with you and a masculine energy or a feminine energy. Take the energy how it resonates. There is no issue between you and this person. But for some reason, I don't know what the fuck this is. Because some of y'all, you would even treat this child like they your own because it's like that's the brother or sister of your children. There's no issue here. Like, this is weird. Yeah, that's what's up. It's like, okay, shit, he got another baby on the way. Or she having another baby. <laughs> what they got to do with me? Yeah, but I'm telling you, the five of one, somebody right here, they want to make an issue with y'all for some reason. I don't understand this. Hmm. This is the same energy that keep trying to tell y'all whomever you are that show tell your your child's father that they they should get a DNA test and all this other kind of shit. Yeah, we got the death card here, Scorpio energy. But somebody like what's the, what's the point? Yeah, somebody don't they I don't understand. This is craziness because I feel I'm hearing kill that noise. So whomever your baby daddy or child's father, whatever you want to call them, I heard ex-husband. Somebody is telling a karmic energy. Yeah, somebody could be Leo here. They tell they telling somebody to chill. Yeah, cause I don't you <laughs> I'm I don't know why because I'm hearing something about you pose no threat. Like you don't want this person. You and this person, that that relationship shit is dead. It's over. It's done. Yeah, but somebody right here, they still press behind you, fam. Yeah, I don't understand. Yeah. This is, it. I get the nine of pentacles right here. We got Virgo energy. We got Libra right here with the justice. We had a four of wands. I feel like this is a situation right here. Where it's like a mutual under... I don't even feel like somebody right here, there's even a child support order in in, in place because it's two people out here who have a mutual understanding about some shit. It's this karmic that won't smoke. Yeah, whomever this person is, that this masculine is like living with now or something like that. I feel like there's a masculine energy that's just trying to keep everything cool and copacetic 
you trying to do the same thing. I really don't feel like you're worried about anything over here. You're just worried about your finances, your home life, your children, if you have them, things like that. But for some reason, yeah, there's a there's a celebration here happening. I'm feeling like it's a pregnancy announcement. It could even be like an engagement or something like that. It's giving best wishes over here while somebody else, they want to kind of like put something in your face. Yeah, I don't know what this person think that they're doing. Like they feel like posting something is going to rip your heart right out of your chest. But you see that over her face. Somebody ain't even going to see this. So it's like you're the topic of a social media um, conversation that you don't even know is going on. You don't see any of this. You have, you are very unaware. Yeah, I don't... Do some of y'all not even have social media? If so, you possibly got this person blocked or they blocked you from a post. I don't know. They blocked you, shit. It, that's the energy that it's given. It's given that somebody blocks you. Like, I don't see you having a reason to block anybody because you don't care. But it feels like there's a karmic energy right here that they've blocked you and they're in their own social media with some of their little friends or whatever. And they're talking shit. Holy Spirit. Yeah. These are some people like, I don't know who this... I, you know, I'm not knocking teenage mothers or anything like that, but it's right here. This is somebody right here. Yeah, they could have had a, a baby very, very young. <laughs> yeah, somebody could even be around the ages of like 54 or 45 now. Yeah, somebody had a child around the ages of 15 or 19 or something like that. I don't know why that's so significant. Yeah, whomever this person is, whomever does this all on social media, something is significant about Lay's chips. But um, they have a real issue with uh, whomever this masculine energy is doing anything in the household for you if this is resonating. Somebody is very much so jealous of y'all for some reason. And it's, it's uncalled for, to be honest with you. Yeah, we got the magician right here. To the Queen of Swords. God damn. It just really feels like somebody right here, they're jealous of your power. I don't know what it is. It's something about, because I'm hearing you really got a hold on me. Somebody really feel like even though, you know, them and this masculine are in a relationship or they're living together, whatever this is, they feel like you still have some type of energetic hold. I'm hearing magnetic hold over this masculine energy. So that's um that's a where a lot of the jealousy is coming in it. But I want to know what this conversation is really about. Hmm. <laughs> somebody right here, I this is like somebody manifesting a baby with this masculine energy thinking that it's just going to like end jaws but see, the thing is, what is there to end? Because I don't feel like there's a relationship between you and this person. But somebody feel like um, having a baby by this person is going to magically make y'all's bond or connection or whatever this is end. And I, I don't, <laughs> I don't get it because <laughs> there is no connection to end. I mean, what are we, what are we doing? Somebody is just really, really pressed by you. Yeah. Y'all are very intuitive. Y'all like y'all are the true magicians right here. So I can under it's like you get everything that you want, pretty much. So somebody is like, if you want this masculine, they know that you can really have them. But they I don't know why people feel like having a baby with somebody is gonna keep them. Shit, some of y'all got children with this person and you ain't with them. So what is what is that telling somebody? Somebody's smoking a hell out of some weed right now. I smell it. Yeah. Also, somebody realizes there's some magic that they trying to throw at y'all. See, it really feels like this because some of y'all, it could be past energy. 
Or this could be like this person has done this shit before and now they're doing it again because it really feel like they somebody is doing something but they realizing that it's not working. Yeah, somebody realizing that you didn't see something or you're not seeing something or you didn't. I don't know. But whatever it is, if it's past, present, or future, just know that somebody is going to realize that you don't see whatever it is that they're trying to throw in your face. <laughs> So they, this is giving somebody did it before they realized that you didn't see it. So now they're amping it up times 10 and now they just know that somebody going to come and tell you some shit. I really don't feel like y'all into the gossip. So whatever somebody come and tell you, it's like, look, if somebody can't come tell me themselves and it, that's, that don't got nothing to do with me. Like, yeah, unless it's like coming straight from the horse's mouth, right in my face, then nah, I'm not trying to hear that shit. Exactly. Yeah, somebody keeps trying to do something to y'all finances as well. <laughs> Damn, it's, I'm hearing back to the drawing board. Whatever it is, it never freaking works. Yeah, look, the Ten of Pentacles right here. Only thing it's doing, it's like you're alchemizing the energy to your advantage. And it's creating more and more wealth. And this is not like money that's passing through your hand. This is like money in the bank. So somebody, they keep trying to break your finances down and, <laughs> and the energy that they send in that weak ass shit, you alchemizing it to 10, 10 times. Exactly. Aries energy right here. Aquarius, Virgo. Yeah, Virgo, Aquarius right there at the bottom of the deck with the hermit. Somebody in, they feel like a damn fool. I don't understand, or they will be. See, this is giving the energy of somebody right here. They were already, somebody that told them, chill with that shit. So I don't know, got to get into what this news is that they just like, they just can't wait to run and talk to talk about, drag your name up in. And I, I, damn, Ace of Pentacles, y'all money looking good. Damn, damn, y'all keep throwing that bullshit ass magic. Fam, gonna fuck around and be a millionaire. Yeah, this is some third party. I see that triangle right there. Some, do you know what? This is, <laughs> child, let me find out that this is some third party who feel like, you know, they won. I feel like they ain't won shit. You're not an option. You're not finna be part of no third party situation. So you bowed out gracefully as the divine feminine or, you know, the divine masculine that you are. So if somebody trying to throw it in your face, that boom, they got your, you're a man or you're a woman or whatever it is, child, please. That's ridiculous. That's childish as fuck. Because if you got them so tough, why are you so pressed about my fam still? Why, why the post and shit? <laughs> I'm just asking a question. Yeah. Mm hmm. Holy Spirit, can I get one more card from this deck, please? Yeah, somebody here, this could even be an engagement announcement. But I'm going to tell y'all something else. Whatever it is that somebody... I don't care if it's an engagement, if it's a baby or whatever. Somebody right here, they did something energetically to get this offer or to, you know, make this happen. Now, that's not for everybody. Yeah, we got the eight of wands right here. I'm telling you something right here. It's a lot of talk. It's a lot of fast moving energy right here. Six of swords. Hmm. So this could be somebody right here. Let's just say you and somebody, y'all done broke up or had some type of argument or something. And they do the same shit that they always do. They either run into social media or they're you know, run into somebody that they've always, you know, kept as a third party or whatever, an option or whatever. Somebody right here, they cannot wait to run to social media and let everybody and their mama know that this uh, masculine energy is back over there with them. Or, yeah, you know, I talked to such and such or whatever, whoop de whoop de blam Yeah, <laughs> man, do they know that you don't give a damn about none of this? You're in manifestation mode, child. You're not finna be thinking about none of this crap. You don't want this mess in your reality. If they want to live over there in Dramaville, then let them do just that. Mm. 
That's also something here about a clothing line. So this is even somebody right here. I don't know what's going on. But it's also something here about two people coming together to build something. So I don't know if two, they done started a company or something together. But somebody right here... They they really want you to see that they're that there is something going on between them and somebody else. This is this is dumb as fuck. Yeah, the two of cups right here. That's crazy. And then look, the two of cups, six of cups, the hangman to the five of pentacles. Hmm. I'm telling you something. Y'all, don't don't even trip if y'all see a picture. Because it's some childish-ass person out here. They're going to snap a picture of somebody while they're laying in the bed with them or something like that spirit is saying. Somebody right here, they're even trying to like uh, post a picture of them and somebody while they were out or something. Man, don't even worry about this shit. This is stupid as fuck. Because, I mean, if the masculine got to tell somebody to chill, yeah, Ace of Swords on the bottom of the deck. Like, really? Why in the hell is he even dealing with somebody like this? See what I'm talking about? They be going and get the most unlike you ass people that they can. <laughs> like, I don't even understand this shit. Yeah, look, the Five of Swords. Whatever it is that somebody posting, they, it's the truth. This person, yeah, they could be living together this person could have contacted them they was together last night whatever the fuck it's the truth but somebody being petty as fuck trying to throw something in your face the thing is i really do feel like if like if this reach you fam because we ain't gonna sit up here and act like we ain't got no motherfucking feelings and stuff as good as we are at hiding and shit some shit when we see that shit or you get back to us it do kind of fuck with us can't make it up three of swords the thing somebody don't realize is this. Y'all see where that emperor is looking at. That queen of this to this ten of cups. Whomever this person is, let's say this information do get back to you. And it hurts your heart. It break your heart. It make you feel some type of uh, way. This masculine energy is going to come running to try to soothe you. To try to make sure that you're okay. So whomever this is, I, I don't know what it is that they trying to do, but I just, it's not going to work out for them the way that they want. Yeah, this could cause some type of rift between them and this masculine energy. Somebody could find themselves ghosted, blocked, whatever the fuck. And it's amazing to me how somebody got to talk shit about you. Why they got your ass on block and everything else? Why they can't unblock you and tag your ass if they want you to see it that bad? Because they coward as fuck. They'll get in a group with their little friends and shit and they'll tear your ass to shit. Yeah, Aquarius energy. They be taking that love and life for granted, I'm telling you. Yeah. <laughs> they think because of, you know, you spiritual and shit. I don't know why people be thinking you scary. Cause that's the that's farthest from the truth. You just know you got shit to lose. <laughs> yeah, but either way it goes, they don't even understand. I don't care what happens between you and this masculine energy. If if something happens, this person is gonna be right there. So whomever this is, they should really take if they just <laughs> if they really want to keep you in this masculine you know, like. They should really just chill. Keep your name out their mouth. Quit all that posting about you and all that other kind of shit. The masculine, I'm already told them to chill. It's unnecessary. So they just over here doing way too much. Being foolish like somebody, I don't, yeah, Aries, Taurus energy again, the emperor out here twice. Some of y'all, it can be same sex, don't have to be. But it just really feel like somebody right here, it's a masculine energy. And they just trying to keep things copacetic cool, and cool. If they do got children by two different people, I feel like this person right here, they're going to handle their responsibility. Ain't no drama except for what the, the other baby mama or whomever the third party is is trying to bring. Like real shit. Holy Spirit. 
What is this announcement? The Six of Pentacles. Oh, excuse me. Holy Spirit. There's some uh body out here, fam. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. This person right here, they're in deep competition with you. This is for y'all to have children with this masculine energy. If y'all resonate with this, this person right here, because I heard I uh find getting what you got. So some of y'all have children with this person, and there is a pregnancy announcement. Somebody is now they like find you know they find they have a baby by the person you have a baby by like why is why is somebody in competition with you about that? And I and the fucked up part about it is they need to understand something, and I'm not even trying to be funny. This masculine energy that I'm talking about, this ain't no bomb. This ain't no deadbeat. This person right here, they could be you know like on their shit, on their own company. If not, they have a job. They ain't laying around waiting on nobody to give them shit. Somebody right here, they need to understand that they in love with somebody right here who I can't say that this person don't love them, but if push come to shove, then they always going to, you know, migrate towards you and not them. And that's just real shit. Yeah, somebody are always like, give to you and make sure that you're good before they do this for another person and so that's another reason why somebody got they so pressed behind y'all they can't be mad at you because of the way that somebody love you and want to give to you that's nuts but that's exactly what this is mm -hmm. somebody is also trying to make something seem a lot bigger than what it is so I don't know if somebody right here, they um gave some, I don't know if this is a gift or I don't know what this is, but it doesn't mean as much to the masculine energy as it does to whomever this third party is. So it's like they're blowing something out of proportion. And for some reason, it's very important to this third party for you to know that they're, they have whatever this is or they're getting whatever this is or whatever. Yeah, the Queen of Cups, somebody here, this is a pregnancy announcement. Aquarius, the star card. That's craziness. This is this third party is giving weird ass vibes. Some of y'all could have three children with this person. There could be angel babies in, uh, involved in the situation as well with you and this masculine. But this is a third party. I don't understand why they even trying. It's like they're trying to convince you. That's, which is weird as fuck because I already feel like y'all know that somebody love y'all and they gonna love y'all forever and ever to the end of days. But it's a, a third party out here that wants to try to make it seem like that this person right here is loving on them and giving them this and giving them that. And I really don't feel like that's the case. I mean, somebody could have helped somebody out with a little financial situation or something like that. I don't know what's really going on out here. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Somebody right here, they help somebody out with money or something like that. It's a pregnancy announcement. Somebody could have helped somebody out with some money or whatever. And now it's just like, boom, I got your boyfriend. Like, I got him. He doing this. He doing that. And that's not even the case. <laughs> Yeah, we get the star card to the King of Cups right here. I feel like y'all dealing with a... This is craziness because I don't feel like there's a... This this masculine energy is a bad dude at all. I'm not getting that. And that's, that's different. I'm not getting that at all. I feel like this person is very generous. They're kind. They're kind. They don't want to be mean to somebody. But at the same time, so this masculine energy needs to, um, to tell this person that the feelings are not mutual. <laughs> That's pretty much what it is. Even if there is a baby involved, I just don't feel like the feelings are mutual. We got the King of Cups right here to the Queen of Cups with the Ten of Pentacles. If you have a family with this person to the Ten of Cups, you're the one that this person is in love with. But it's like, y'all, it's some type of mutual understanding or something out here. So, yeah, somebody could have went off and had another baby and everything else. Yeah, they could be starting, you know, had, 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 uh, in addition to the family. And that's a good thing. I don't see it bothering y'all at all. 
Yeah, whomever this for somebody is also trying to affect y'all finances, fam. Through some type of energetic manipulation. But they don't see, and this is another reason why somebody they need to stop coming for y'all. Cause y'all see how those houses over there, the three of pentacles, they're doing work on you. This is work to affect your finances, your living situation, or something like that. Yeah, two of pentacles to throw something out. Yeah, then we got the, the five right here. So you'll be in some type of lack. But all of this right here is together. And y'all see how that building keeps going up and those houses are going down. Something right here, whomever this is doing this energetic work on your finances, they don't realize that you are a high priest or a high priestess and you feel the energy here. And so it's like you've already put up some type of protection around your finances. And so things going to keep flourishing. It's like you're out, you're already invested into your financial growth. So whomever this is that's trying to come in and like break down any type of foundation that you have, financial, emotional, uh, home life, whatever, they're going to have one hell of a time here. Yeah. This is craziness. I don't, Holy Spirit. What's this conversation? The ten of wands right here. <laughs> to the six of wands. I'm telling you, this is like, boom, I got your boyfriend. I got your man. And whatever this is, somebody going to have to end up eating their words. Oh, no. Somebody right here, whomever this third party is. See, you're, whomever this masculine is, they ain't bummy. They live alone. They can even be a homeowner or they have a really nice apartment or whatever this is. Somebody right here, they flexing while they with this person in this home. They gonna fuck around and get put out and have to walk or get an Uber or a Lyft or something like that. Because this masculine is telling them they doing way too much. They flexing on social media trying to piss you off. And in turn, they really finna make this masculine turn on them. Yeah, Sagittarius energy. Yeah, the devil, you can't make this shit up. This is absolutely nuts. It's a whole lot of toxic ass shit. Like, it's a lot of negative comments going on on this post about you. For no reason. Like, it's 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 no reason for this. Yeah, the eight of swords right here. Whomever the... I don't know what's going on, but yeah, this is a major backfire. Ten of ones to the eight of swords. Whatever it is that somebody's saying, they're going to have to eat the fuck out of them words. Because it's like somebody putting a halt to something like real fucking quick. And this is somebody like, wait, what the fuck happened? Somebody getting caught up in their own shit right here. Yeah, the page of pentacles. This is uh, this also feels like this is somebody like coming to your defense. Like, yeah, I that's what I'm saying. Whomever this man's because I don't really feel like y'all have an issue with each other. It's like somebody thinks you're a good mother, you do what you have to do, you handle your responsibilities. So, whomever this karmic energy is, is over here, if they think they finna talk shit about you without this masculine saying something, they got another goddamn thing coming. Yeah. Holy Spirit. And I don't know who this is out here talking about you doing dark magic or some shit like that. Hell no, you ain't. Only magic I see you doing is uh to improve your finances, keep your vibrations high, and then and, and you know enough strength and uh you know decency, sanity to deal with all this bull that, that people keep trying to throw at you on a daily goddamn basis. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody's possibly having a baby with the karmic, y'all. But, hey, that's on them, shit. Mm -hmm. I want some of y'all to understand that, oh, y'all, yeah, the Knight of Pentacles right here. So, some of y'all, I don't know what this phone call or this message is. So, maybe you and somebody... Y'all always send each other a good morning text. And also, my condolences, because that came up. It's like somebody is used to sending somebody a good morning text. 
but they're not able to do that anymore. My condolences. We do have a death card out here. So somebody could be mourning the death of a mother, father, a child, or, you know, whatever the case may be. Shit, a pet. Somebody just lost a pet. Yeah, my condolences either way it goes. But yeah, um, back to what I was saying. If this is the energy of somebody right here, they're being with somebody. Somebody sent a text message. Y'all text each other all the time. It's some. It's just like, you know, hey, such and such needs some new shoes or something like that. Whatever it is, you sent the text in the middle of these people going through, you know, having this discussion about you. Yeah. So that could have been what, this could have been what sparked all of this shit that this talk that's going on on social media and everything else. Also, this is somebody that pays. So it's like somebody left some money on the dresser. Like, I don't know what somebody, if they thought this, uh, that somebody was staying there with them. Like, I don't know, but somebody left some money on the dresser and got the fuck up out of there. So I don't know what the fuck this is. Yeah. Yeah, we get the four of wands again. Yeah, to the two of wands. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. <laughs> Holy Spirit. Mm. Holy Spirit. Yeah, we get the six of ones right here to the death card. I don't know. If, if there is somebody talking about, you know, them and somebody is together or, you know, something about getting married, this is like wishful fucking thinking. So I don't know why somebody would even post this. So maybe somebody posted, you know how they always do. Somebody done changed their last name to somebody else's last name. Some, some Smith Thomas. Yeah, and they just really hoping that you see this shit. Somebody looking at them like, why in the hell did you do that? Like, you need to change your name back. Somebody has no intentions on, on marrying this person. It's just, that's where the, the engagement shit came from. That's wishful thinking. Somebody out here on social media, that's what it is. They done changed their last name to this masculine last name. And they hoping like, hell, you see it or some shit like that. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> yeah, you don't give a damn about nothing. None of this. Yeah, Virgo, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius. I just really feel like whomever this is, they doing this. It's like whatever it is, it's a temporary, it's a shallow victory as fuck. <laughs> so they can talk about you in them comments how they want to. Yeah, they ain't going to never come and say it to your face. Exactly. Seven of Cups. This person is out here creating illusions, confusion. They're delusional as fuck. Yeah. I don't know why people be thinking just because they get with a masculine that treated you, you know, like the queen, the divine feminine, or, the, you know, that you got with a feminine that treated you as the divine masculine that you are, that they going to treat this other person the same way. Yeah, no. Somebody absolutely loves you. They're in love with you. The feelings are real. Over here, okay, it could be a little feelings, but it's also more so something to do. Yeah, Aries, Taurus energy, this emperor energy. Somebody is really confused as to like, what, why, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> like, yeah, there's also somebody out here that's, uh, there's a masculine energy right here. I don't know why somebody think that they can buy this person. So somebody has given this masculine energy some type of gift. Yeah, Leo energy right here. I don't know if to strengthen the bond between them or something. I really feel like this masculine energy, all they think about is you. And it's like somebody can feel that. Yeah, Hierophant, you can't make this up. You and somebody could be on a break right now. And I don't know what's going on out here. Yeah, somebody got a job. They been having a job. So, yeah, this ain't no bummy-ass energy. This could even be somebody that they work with, that they started dealing with since y'all ain't been dealing with each other or something. <laughs> like, I don't know what this is. Yeah, somebody damn sure need to cut it out. It's temporary as fuck. They are, so, y'all already know. This is whatever this is, it's temporary. Somebody right here, it's like, 
they have your masculine for a moment and it's i don't i don't know whether you want them back or not i don't really feel like this is a situation and y'all want each other back but it's like a bond it's like mutual love on one level or another but it's also respect of uh, each other as an individual so yeah i don't know what the hell this karmic energy yeah somebody right here you have children somebody your ex I, baby please Okay, just know that if you wanted your ex back, you can have them. They'll leave whomever this is in the high New York minute. If you said, okay, come on, let's get back together. So somebody ultimately, they are making themselves look like a goddamn fool by trying to involve you in whatever this madness is that they have going on because they extra pressed and jealous about you. This crazy. Somebody actually want to have a baby by your masculine simply because you have children by him. So I, I'm, I'm telling you. Some of y'all, all y'all masculines ain't treated y'all like shit. Somebody masculine actually treated them okay. But you know something, everything don't go the long call. Let's get y'all some signs. Holy shit, what's the... Yeah, we got Earth out here. Earth has been prominent. So it's giving a real grounded, stable energy. That's what I'm saying. Exactly. Taurus. Holy Spirit. We get fire. We have a Taurus and fire in their chart. Yeah, we get Aries right here. Holy Spirit. We get air. So we get a lot of elements. Yeah, we get Leo right here as well. Can I get two more, please? Holy shit. Yeah, we get Sun. And we get Virgo. So this is seeming very specific. We have Taurus. We have Aries, Leo, as well as Virgo. This could be somebody's Sun, Moon sign. Also, these people could have Air or Earth highly aspected in their chart. But yeah, fam, that's been your message. Hopefully, it gave you some type of clarity. If it did, y'all, please hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, y'all. Personal readings are open. If you're interested, all of that information can and will be found in the description box of the channel. It's always my pleasure, of course, fam. I thank y'all so much for allowing me to read for y'all. I'm sending you guys love and healing energy wherever y'all may be. In this crazy ass world fam. And we'll most definitely get back up.